answer. We finally have an answer as to what Mandalorian Season 4 will look like. And to that, my friends and acolytes, there will not be a Season 4 anytime soon. And that's because Star Wars revealed just today that officially, the fourth season of The Mandalorian has now been transitioned into a feature film and will go to movie theaters. In an article posted on StarWars.com, it says this, The Mandalorian and Grogu are embarking on a new adventure to movie theaters. Directed by John Favreau and produced by Favreau, Kathleen Kennedy, and Dave Filoni, The Mandalorian and Grogu will go into production in 2024. I have loved telling stories set in the rich world that George Lucas created, said Favreau. The prospect of bringing the Mandalorian and his apprentice Grogu to the big screen is extremely exciting. John Favreau and Dave Filoni had ushered into Star Wars two new and beloved characters, and this new story is a perfect fit for the big screen. The Mandalorian and Grogu will lead Lucasfilm's ongoing feature development slate, including films helmed by Shereem Obeid, Chinoy, James Mangold, and Dave Filoni, who is also developing Ahsoka Season 2. With this announcement, we now have a better idea of the slate of Star Wars films and projects moving forward. Again, one of the massive details here is that Ahsoka Season 2 has now been officially confirmed, and it's likely that we could see Ahsoka either 2025 or 26. Of course, with this all leading up to the grand finale of the film that many have been calling Heir to the Empire, which will follow Thrawn and his arrival to the known universe after the events of Season 2 and the Mando film. This also likely means that we will not be getting, of course, a Season 4 of The Mandalorian just yet, and rather that story has been transitioned into a full-on movie. So when exactly can we expect to see this? Well, they don't give an exact date of when production will begin for the Mando movie, officially titled The Mandalorian and Grogu, they only say that they will be entering into production in 2024, and it's likely that the Rey movie will enter into production before the Mando movie since that was announced several months ago. Previously, Star Wars has found huge success in around the holiday season and releasing films in December. Originally, The Force Awakens was released in December, with The Last Jedi and The Rise of Skywalker having original dates around summertime. But after the massive success of The Force Awakens, nearly all of the Star Wars films, with only one exception, were released in December around the holiday season. What I'm getting at is I believe that we could see the Rey film released sometime in spring or perhaps early summer of 2025, but I do believe that The Mandalorian Season 4, or now The Mandalorian and Grogu, could likely release around December of 2025. Although of course an official release date has not been given, neither has an official production date, we just know that they are entering production this year. This will mark a very important move, as Star Wars and the Mandoverse will be officially moved to the big screen theatrically for the first time with The Mandalorian, and not an heir to the Empire as many of us initially anticipated. This of course though is all building up to Thrawn and the Grand Threat, as well as likely the threat of Abeloth, which was hinted at at the end of Ahsoka Season 1. As to when we could expect to see an Ahsoka Season 2, I would absolutely love to see that sometime in 2025, but it is likely that Ahsoka Season 2 could lead directly into the events of Heir to the Empire and the big threat of Grand Admiral Thrawn, likely being released sometime in 2026 or maybe 2027. As of right now, we now have four films officially slated for theatrical release in the Star Wars realm, the first being the Rey film which will likely release sometime next year, and after that, The Mandalorian and Grogu, followed by the movie being directed by James Mangold which will document the original Jedi Order and some of the first Jedi in a galaxy far far away. And then of course, entering into the Heir to the Empire film, where we will see a group of Star Wars characters established all coming together to face Thrawn and perhaps an even larger threat, with Heir to the Empire again being a temporary title. In terms of some of the best news, we do know that Jon Favreau, who's the original creator of The Mandalorian, will also be directing this film. This also means though that a lot of the fans accusing Season 3 of The Mandalorian to being mostly filler were ultimately correct, with the plan now to transition into the big screen screen with a live action film. But again my friends, the big takeaways today are, The Mandalorian Season 4 is no longer a series of television but is a theatrical release, and that Ahsoka Season 2 has been officially announced. But anyway my friends, what do you guys think about this? Are you excited for Season 4 of The Mandalorian to now be a film? And what are your thoughts on the second season of Ahsoka? Thank you so much for stopping by the channel today, stay tuned later for a full lore video, and may the force be with you.